Hello Jeffrey, so welcome back to my channel. With respect to the video prepared previously about how to create a secure business on the online sector, I'm here to prepare a second video. Now this second video is continuing from where I stopped. The previous video I talked about how to create a secure e-commerce platform, put it on the air, but I also encourage you to do a little more homework because that was just a typical heads up. Now I'm going to continue by telling you how to secure your space and make it more professional and neat by using Google G Suite. Now what is Google G Suite? As you can see right here, Google G Suite is a place that brings, let me highlight this for you to see, just a second please, Um, right here, okay. Now as you can see here, Google G Suite is a place that brings together your Google application in a simple yet effective suite. It allows you to professionally collaborate and address your productivity needs in one domain. So now the question is how do you get to create a G Suite account? Of course, the process is user friendly and it is straight up direct to the point of which I'm going to I highlight for you. Now from what you can see in this article, the process is going to take you nothing less than or nothing more than 10 to 20 minutes. So in about 20 minutes, you must have completed your G Suite account and then you have a professional business branding. So now, how do you create the G Suite account? Here are three steps that you can use in creating your G Suite account. Now, the first step here is going to the website, Google G Suite website. A link to this has been pasted in the description box below. So simply access it, click on the get started button when you are there. Now, after doing this, you will see the option for setting up your account. Set up your account and then you will be considered a G Suite admin. Now, the next thing you want to do is you want to enter your business name, the name in relation to the e-commerce business that you've just created already. Now, after doing that, you might decide to add the number of employees that are working for you or if they are none, it doesn't matter. If you're just the only one in your business for now, you can simply indicate there just for professionalism's sake right then after that you will need to put your personal information as you can see right here now this personal information is going to be used by google for your company location and billing only after which then you will need to set up your domain now if you're able to create the e-commerce platform i told you earlier and you're able to buy a host a hosting plan then good for you this becomes a lot easier simply click simply by clicking on this yes i have a domain you will need to put your domain now let me say www.ecommerce.com exactly that was what i mean by domain by hosting yeah <laughs> yes that's what i'm talking about however if you have not created one you can simply click no i need i don't need one for now or you can simply click no i need one and then you see the option for purchasing a domain name immediately the domain name is something like the e-commerce there e-commerce then the .com is the host that's why we have .com .com.ng .com you understand what i'm talking about sorry the .com is the domain the .com.ng the .in the .ai those are the domain then when we talk about the host we are talking about something about um, we are talking about bluehost namecheap and things like that that's what i mean here now after which the next thing you will need to do hey uh -huh, here's just pop up Yes, a pop-up of a free trial about this Google Workspace I'm talking about here. However, since this is a video, I will not be opening the free trial for you. When you want to explore this, you can feel free to access the free trial. Now, after setting in your domain, that's the next step. It's going to take about um some 10 to 15 minutes to complete this step. However, for your domain to come on air and start and start being fully functional, it's going to take roughly some one hour sometimes it takes up to a day that's on extreme cases however it's may rally up to a but this is a very very rare case nonetheless that's just what you need now after doing that you need to set a managing site a managing setup for your g suite account here you can see this this includes the plan the financial plan here we are talking about and then after which like I said, you can decide to add the number of people that will be using your G Suite account with you. Let me say your workers or your team members. That's what I mean right there. It is actually very adjustable and tweakable. So after that, you need to verify your domain name with G Suite. And this is the last part of it all. 
your platform is up and running now you need to verify it before you can now start thinking about introducing adsense to the race so that you can be earning from the system as you get to you know as people get to visit your platform and patronize you so now you have two means of earning through the google adsense or whatever advertisers out there and then the service your own rendering is paying you so you see you have something to do however this is very good for thriving business already so you need to set up something and then make it professional using these softwares and tools that i'm telling you about in this video now i want you to know that there are other tools this is a very this very one i'm talking about is a paid version you're going to pay for google g suits so if you don't have money to pay for google g suits then you can simply do everything manually by yourself i know a lot of people that started blogging that started youtube that started things different businesses they did it manually they did not get to use g suit however for professionalism and all in one package you can simply use g suit that's all about it then you set up your dns after setting up your dns that's all your G Suite is, uh, your G Suite account is ready and then you can start earning passively i'm going to see you in the next review video i'm going to see you in the next video this is not a review so um you can simply give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to continue seeing content like this see you soon